Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with a fun one here. 2024 Hit Parade Baseball Autographed Platinum Edition Series 5 Dual Case 20 boxes total Random Team Break number 1 and at the end we're going to see who's going to get an entry to Chase the Mantle. Big thanks to this group right here for making it happen. Look at this. We only ended up doing one filler. Congrats to the people who won. All 30 baseball teams are in. Let's roll it. Let's randomize names and teams five and one six times. One, two, three, four, five, and a one sixth and final time. Five and a one six times for the teams. One, two, three, four, five, and a one sixth and final time. All right, John, you got the Tigers. Diego with the Giants. Paul with the White Sox. Kevin with the Cubs. John, you got my Dodgers. Jimmy with the Rays. Richard with the Angels. Mike with the Diamondbacks. Gila with the Mariners. De uh, Diego with the Braves. Uh, David, David M with the Red Sox. Joe, you got the Mets. James, Orioles. Last spot, Mojo. Lonnie with the Twins. James with the Royals. Richard with the Cardinals. Mark with the Nationals. Michael with the Padres. Alan with the Blue Jays. Uh, David with the Rockies, Eugene with the Guardians, Lonnie with the Brew Crew, David with the Pirates, Gila with the Reds, Matt M with the Phillies, Matt L with the Astros, Diego with the Marlins, Joe with the Rangers, John with the A's, and Joe Lawson, New York Yankees. It's alphabetized by team. And the trade window is open. We're going to pause the video when we come back. We'll see if there's any trades, and then we will have the break. So BRB. All right, welcome back, folks. No deals were done, so the list is officially printed out and remains the same as you saw it on your computer screen, your screen, and tablet screen, possibly, phone screen, TV screen, on a screen. Logan calling an Ellie Dela Cruz. That would make... That would make Gilo very happy. All right, so there it is. Platinum Edition, all autographed. Series 5, you can see right there. All right, first of two cases. Good luck, everybody. All right, first one out of the gate is going to be uh, Zach Geloff. 90 out of 250, purple chrome autograph going to John and the A's. One of their, uh, one of their top prospects. I think his brother... Get his brother's name. I think his brother's in the Dodgers farm system. Next up, we've got a thicker card here, and it is from Flawless. It's Anthony Rizzo, Cubs edition. 7 out of 10. Nice, from 2021, Flawless. That'll, that'll be uh, going to, to Kevin and the Cubs. We got Flawless on the website, ladies and gentlemen. Flawless Baseball, jazbeescasebreaks.com. Check it out. And NT Baseball. And Immaculate Baseball. Uh, some different years, too. Oh, wow, Wyatt Langford. Oh, that's a case hit. Let's save that. 
can see that still on camera right there. So let's save that one to the end. I like that they started doing that in recent, in recent product here. All right, and we've got some Dynasty, Dustin Pedroia Laser Show, three out of 10. Nice patch, black ink autograph. That's from 2015 Dynasty. It's gonna be for David and the Bow Sox. Was Logan right? I didn't see. I did not peek. Yeah, Laser Show. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Remember him? I love him, man. Yeah, he was great. That's an awesome card. 2015 Dynasty, old school Dynasty, too. Laser Show. All right. Got a Panini sticker on here. It is Michael Harris, four out of eight. That might be from a first off the line. Like I said, we've got Immaculate Baseball in the shop as well, jazbeescasebreaks.com. Nice one for the Braves. That'll be for Diego. Another case hit? I'm not sure if that's intentional or if that's a mistake. Well, we got we got two. Oh yeah, so that Michael Harris is first off the line. Nice, thanks, James. All right, let's see what's in here. Ooh, nice Juan Soto. Padres edition, jersey, piece of lumber. He's always got a nice autograph. 23 out of 25. Sterling baseball is really cool too. Michael, Michael Cohen with the Friars. How is, how is he, uh, Logan's like, boo, traitor, a traitor, a traitor, I think, not traitor, but he was traded. Should be boo Padres. There is Sal Freelick from Bowman Sterling. PSA 10, one of the big brewers prospects. 82 out of 99, he's getting some, I think he's getting some regular playing time. That's gonna be for uh, Lonnie and the Brew Crew. Oh, so Wyatt Langford actually called out at second. I was gonna say, a double and a triple on the day, it's pretty nice, could be a nice day for him. Right, yeah, you still have to complain. I agree. All right, here is Donnie Baseball, Don Mattingly from Topps Chrome Black. Wow. Derek Hill's second home run. Four hundred and thirty six feet, jeez. We may have something here with Derek Hill and the Rangers. How about this? First two pitches slide or another pitch back in. We're sticking to that scouting report and Derek Hill immediately is saying that's not working. 
All right. There's Freddie Freeman, Dodgers edition. From a definitive collection. I like that. Nice Freddie going to John and my Dodgers. All right. We were lucky enough to get two case hits here. So here's the first one. This is a, a graded card, graded case hit. And it is Ellie Dela Cruz. Sharp eyes from James, PSA 10. 2022 Bowman Sterling, Ellie Dela Cruz prospect autographs. And that's gonna go to Gilo and the Cincinnati Reds. Gilo won some break credit, bought into this uh, this hit parade rewarded already. Nice. And Logan called it too, yeah, before the break. He was like, I'm, I'm calling a uh, Nelly Dela Cruz. All right. Here's the other case hit. And that is Mark McGuire, one of one. Nice. Richard with the Cardinals. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo -woo. Nice. But wait, there's more. Don't worry, Alan. Alan's like, where are the Blue Jays? There's another case to go, Alan. We're not done yet. So second case, good luck everybody. We got a thick one here. We got a thick one. And it is Xander Bogarts. Three color patch, six out of 10. Nice auto there. From a really nice product, Dynasty. That's another uh, Red Sox for David. The Pedroia was there earlier in the first case. Got the Xander in the second case. Oh, nice. You just got a bobblehead from a uh, of Xander. Okay, nice. Got a graded card here. Looks like a Beckett slab. And it's CJ Abrams from 2019 Bowman Chrome Draft 9510. Centering, edges, corners, all a 9-5. The surface is a 9. His auto is a 10. Playing really well uh, for the Nats. But this is still Padres edition, so it'll go to Michael and the Padres. I mean, the Nationals also have a bunch of youngsters on that team coming up the ranks. They could look like the... Uh, I think it looked like the Orioles within, within a season or two. Oh, case it. So we'll save that, put that back there. Got another card from Dynasty. There are the Blue Jays, George Springer. Two color patch and autograph, seven out of 10. 
Alan Murdoch and the Bluebirds. George Springer, I think, feel like starting to kind of turn things around a little bit. That's right, yeah. Nats prospect James Wood being called up for tomorrow's game. I think he looked really good in spring training. I think he was hitting a lot of homers in spring training. They had him start off the season in uh, in the minors, but I think he's been proving that that he's ready for the promotion. All right. Another thick card, and it is Bobby Witt Jr., 16 out of 50 from Five Star Baseball. And that's going to be for James and the Royals. He was calling his shot earlier, too. Bobby Witt Jr. having a really nice year. By the way, that Bobby Bobby Wood Jr. is 2023 five star. Future AL MVP says James. That'd be that'd be good for the hobby. I've been keeping track of. Uh, there's a great website that keep track of the MVP odds this year. He is. Anywhere from plus 1,400 to plus 2,100. He's behind Aaron Judge, Gunnar Henderson, Juan Soto. Yeah, maybe not this year, but I mean, eventually, I feel like he's going to be in the mix. All right, next auto. It's Casey Schmidt, 188 out of, one, uh, out of 499. Bowman first autograph, Giants, that's going to be for Diego. This guy is from San Diego. Are these uh, James Woods minor minor league numbers, Jack? All right. Next up is wow. Speaking of the Nationals, that's a rookie auto, Trey Turner. Twenty-two out of one fifty. Mark with the Nats. It's from Tops Finest. Twenty sixteen. Yeah, Jack is saying James Wood in a little under 200 at bats, 44 runs, 67 hits, 10 homers, 37 RBIs. It's not bad. And he's stealing bases, over a thousand OPS. All right, next up is Jeremy Pena, 43 out of 50. Nice one, nice rookie auto for Matt Lieber and the Strohs. Do I wish, uh, yeah, I think I wish I would have liked to have Corey Seager, Trey Turner, but I mean, in spite of what some some may think Dodgers can't sign everybody. You know, so I, I knew they realized that they're going to have to let some of those hitters walk in order to try to secure guys like Mookie, Freddie, Will Smith. Got an extension this year and obviously Shohei. Well, they moved him to second, so I think Gavin Lux is pretty much a second baseman. So I think he's done defensively. He's done a lot better on that on that side. All right, next one here. Nice select baseball, Jason Dominguez. Ninety-nine out of one forty-nine Yankees. Joe Lawson. One sort of 
small concern for the Dodgers is I feel like they've not developed they've developed a lot of great pitching. They have not really developed a lot of great hitting. They haven't developed a lot of position players in recent years. You know, I think the jury is still out on Gavin Lux offensively and defensively. You know, they got Andy Pajes up, they got Miguel Rojas or uh, Miguel Vargas up. So they got a couple of some a few youngsters there who are trying to shred the prospect sort of the prospect badge and try to become everyday starters. So there is a Francisco Lindor rookie auto. Wow. Nice for the then Indians, now Guardians Eugene with Cleveland. Cleveland, this is for you. 56 out of 99. So yeah, we'll, we'll see. Yeah, the Dodgers could, that's why they need those, those kind of hitting prospects to pan out because they are a little top heavy, you know. Seven, eight, nine in the order has, has done a lot better in recent, in recent weeks, but you know, it'd be great to develop one and uh, one or two and have them at the bottom of the uh, Dodgers lineup. All right, case hit. What's it gonna be? I think it's landscape mode. I think it's this way. It's a thick one. Woo! From Select Baseball. A button and autograph, Ronald Acuna Jr. Six out of 10. That's gonna go to Diego and the Braves. Poor Ronald Acuna. Hopefully, hopefully he bounces back strong from the injury, but still nice. There you go, Diego. Love that button too, super low number. Always love seeing that. All right, now, whether you hit or not, guess what? You've got a chance to chase the Mickey Mantle. Let's flip back over here. Let's gather everybody's names, one through 30 and everyone in between. Only one winner of an entry. Fingers crossed, everybody. Good luck. Get the lucky rabbit's foot, get the four leaf clover, get the, get the lucky horseshoe, all that stuff. Pray to the hobby gods. Let's roll it. Randomize it three and a four seven times name on top after seven good luck one two three four five six and Seventh and final time Now after seven again only one entry only one person can win so there's a lot of sad faces here But I appreciate everybody giving it a shot Sorry, Jimmy, Jimmy very close just no cigar there, but thanks everybody we're a little over halfway there on entries. We've got, we got to do 200 total. A little over halfway there, but there's still a, a ways to go, so I hope everyone keeps trying. But after seven, there could be only one winner, and that's going to be James. Different James. James L. Getting in there. Congrats. You're chasing the mantle. I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com, and I'll see you next time for the next break. Bye-bye.